नमस्ते स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू अवर आर एस पी ग्रुप ऑफ स्कूल यूट्यूब चैनल टूडे अवर टॉपिक इज रोमन न्यूमरल्स ये स्टूडेंट्स वॉट डू यू मीन बाय रोमन न्यूमरल्स लेट सी रोमन नंबर सिस्टम इज बेस्ड ऑन सेवन लेटर्स ऑफ एल्फाबेट्स ऑल द नंबर आर रिटर्न using either one letter or a combination of letters however there is no letter representing zero yes students so in roman numerals we will use seven letters yes as you can see one table is drawn here and some letters are also there some letters and their value yes letter first is i v x l c d m so how many letters we will use seven letters and their value is yes letter i value is 1 letter v value is 5 letter x value is 10 letter l value is 50 letter c value is 100 letter d value is 500 and letter m value is 1000 so in roman numerals we will use how many letters seven letters yes students when we will write down the roman numerals we will follow some rules so let's see the rules yes rules for writing the roman numerals rule 1 symbol i f c and m can be repeated the numbers yes symbol i x rule 1 symbol i x c and m can be represent the number symbol i x and c cannot be repeated for more than 3 times so symbol b and d cannot be repeated for more than once yes students in roman numerals letter b and d cannot be repeated more than one time yes for example our number is 3 yes our hindu arabic number is 3 and we will write down this number in roman numeral so we will use how many times i yes we will use three times i now we will take another example for example our number is 30 Hindu al Hindu alphabet number is thirty, and we will write down this number in Roman numerals. Yes, students. In Roman numerals, value of x is ten, so we will use three times x. So one time x value is ten, then twenty, then thirty. So three times x, it means value is thirty. Yes. Let's take another another example. For example. Our number is 300, and we will write down this number in Roman numerals. Yes, students. In Roman numerals, value of c is 100. So we will use how many times c? Yes, three times c. So 100 plus 100 plus 100, it means 300. Clear? Now we will take rule two. Yes, rule two is. A smaller numeral written to the right of right of a numeral of greater value is always added to the greater numerals. Yes, we will take some example. Yes, for example, our Roman numeral is B X. So we will write down this Roman numeral in Hindu Arabic numbers. Yes, students. Value of b is five and value of i is one. 
so we will add 5 plus 1 equal to 6 so value of bi it means 6 now we will take another example for example our number is xv yes value of x is 10 and value of v is 5 so 10 plus 5 equal to 15 so value of xv equal to 15 clear to all yes now we will take some another example for example our number is alex yes alex value of l is 50 and value of x is 10 so 50 plus 10 equal to 16 another example for example our number is c x yes students value of c is 100 and value of x is 10 so when we add 100 plus 10 equal to our answer is 110 so we will follow the rule 2 clear to all yes rule 3 a smaller numeral written to the left of a numeral of greater value is always subtract from the greater numerals. Yes, let's take an example. For example, our Roman numeral is I, V. As you can see, I is, I value is smaller than V. So, Roman numeral I, V equal to 5 minus 1. Yes. So, our answer is 4. Let's take another example. For example, our Roman numeral is XL. Value of X is 10 and value of L is 50. So, 50 minus 10 equal to 40. Clear to all? Yes. Now, we will take another example. For example, our number is XC. Yes, students. C value is 100 and X value is 10. So, we will minus 100 minus 10 equal to our answer is 90. Yes students. So today we will learn. Yes. Today we will learn. In Roman numerals we will use 7 letters and their value also. And we will follow the some rules when we will write down the Hindu Arabic num numeral into Roman numerals. Thank you.